that's a Trojans dance crew, and I've got the team members standing right here next to me, ready to do their thing. Trojans dance crew, welcome to the show. Yeah, thank you. Pleasure yeah. to have you guys over here. And I'm talking to the main man over here, who is none other than Josh. Yeah. Josh, yeah. you guys, I just seen that on television on the screens over there. I told the viewers. First of all, Josh, let me ask you, how did you guys come together as a group? Where did you all meet? Um, we met in some one on one dance competition. Mm -hmm. Yeah, it was an underground competition. And it was a challenge to us. It was one on one. Yeah. Uh, but I was facing the same guys. Yeah. I got to realize that we all have unique power moves. We yeah. all have unique talents because right. we don't do dance only. Okay. We also do beatboxing. So we thought maybe to change the dance industry in Uganda, it would be better if we form up like a strong team mm -hmm. comprised of guys of different talents and unique talents. And why the name Trojan? Uh, we came up with that Trojan because a Trojan, as per the Internet Dictionary, yeah. is a person of courageous determination. Uh -huh. And we got that determination. You got that. All right, Josh, just, I know there's one member of the uh, crew who's not around here, mm -hmm. but just take me through. point out who is who over here. Um, right here is Foster Fataki, aka okay. Foster Fataki Trojans. Okay. And um, Josh Segawa Joseph, uh, aka Josh Trojans. Okay. Is Muslim oh. Bright, right. aka Syrian Bright Trojans. Mm -hmm. And Freddy Ice Trojans. It's so sad that our fifth member is not around. His dad is sick. Oh, okay. Okay. Dad is in and his name is? He's kind of a baby Trojan. Okay, cool. Yeah, well, 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 we'll support him from here, okay? Now, you guys have performed in many places. You guys have been doing this for a while. I'm, I'm seeing over here, you performed at the Sakata Mashiriki, the Shakin Dance Party, uh, the Corporate End of Year Party. The Eddie Wamala uh, old tribute concert you guys were actually there at uh, Serena amongst others. Mm -hmm. um, so you guys obviously do quite a bit. You know, you you, you get invited to many events and you, and you perform. How do people sort of receive? Um, I must say, 2014 was our year, mm -hmm. and the audience where we, where, where we perform is ever crazy. Mm -hmm. Uh, you can witness it like in the recent Sakata Mashari competitions where the guys were putting on to pull uniforms. I believe guys so much happened. You watched that show. It was so massive. We felt so happy that we could change the audience, which was not ours. Because Sakata, the audience was purely Kenyan. Most of them were Kenyans. Yeah, but we couldn't believe that those guys could bow for us. All of them were like, Igwe, Igwe. It was so massive. And there are some other shows we've been doing around town, like the recent one was Yugi Mix Dance Party at Sheraton, the okay. audience was also crazy. The was High People Music Awards, the mm -hmm. audience was also crazy. Mm -hmm. Then the kids down there, Bass, Divas Rock, Kadanke, those ones just <laughs> ones. <laughs> so tell me something, George, real quick. Yeah. Is dancing, it, you guys find there's a lot of competition out over there? I mean, I've seen several dancers who are true, you know, uh, depending on what you call yourselves. But is the competition is, is it tough out there? Yeah, the competition is actually stiff because many crews are coming up. Mm -hmm. Yeah, recently we've been seeing many crews as in doing it like almost to our level, but still we beat them bad. Yeah, yeah. And your music videos, we saw the example of uh, some of the stuff. Did you guys, you know, I mean, you're doing backflips, you're doing yeah. what are those things where you play as? <laughs> <laughs> you know, you're playing as the crowd and stuff like that. Yeah. I mean, how much time and effort goes into actually putting your dance moves together and also your music videos? Um, music videos, actually, we do online training mm -hmm. with most of our best tutors around the world. Okay. So we share ideas on YouTube and we do workshops around town, mm -hmm. like the National Theatre, we attend some workshops. Mm -hmm. Yeah, and basically, Uganda is self-taught. So I can't leave out that part of us being self-taught. Yeah. By the time we came to me to form a group, mm -hmm. we all had unique talents, we all had different moves. Okay. Yeah. Um, I mean, I'm, I'm, me, when I do my moves, me, I'm on those ones, you know? <laughs> simple, simple, simple. Uh, how much do you guys actually train? How much do you, how fit do you have to be to be able to do what Trojans does to us? All right, so that's right now. It has a trend. We are setting a trend. We want the dance industry to catch up because mm -hmm. we have actually a, a motive from the comedian industry. Those guys were from scratch, but right now they stage shows in the Monita and Chat 20K. Mm -hmm. So we also have that in future. So right now, we are putting in a lot of effort. Mm -hmm. We do road work early morning. Um, you have to do a little bit of gym to be stronger. Okay. Yeah, and then you have to practice like daily to keep fit. Mm -hmm. yeah. Now, obviously, like I mentioned earlier, you do a lot of these gigs and all of that. Is there one particular gig that you guys have done that stands out and you say, man, there we killed it? Is there any one that really stands out? I'll still take you back to Sakata Mashari. That was the one for you guys. 
That was my best in 2014. For all of you? Yeah. Oh, yeah. 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 Uh, now, you've got your dance moves, uh, you do your training. What plans uh, do you have for 2015 going forward in terms of, you know, the events or what you want to do or, or how you want to stand out in the moment? Yeah. So 2015, basically we have our major plan. Mm. Yeah, it's been like our goal ever since. Mm. We want to inspire the youth and we want to rehabilitate. We want to set up like a project. Oh, really? Yeah, okay. like a charity project. Because down there, when you go to the ghetto, there are very many kids who are there. They have nothing to do. They don't go to school. Parents don't have money. Mm. Um, but they do nothing. So they end up going to drugs because they believe when you sing or when you dance, you have to do drugs. Mm. So we want to set up a project this 2015. Okay. Um, if you're lucky and get sponsors, then it will be very fine. We want to rehabilitate the youth. More so in the ghetto. Mm -hmm. yes. uh, do, do, do young children, do, do, do young people look up to you guys? Do they sort of come up to you and say, Yeah, you, know, you inspire me, you give me a bit of direction, what I want to do? Do they look up to you guys? Yes, yeah. they do. Very many of them post. When you go to our Facebook page, mm -hmm. when you see that post by others, Comments, yes. yeah, most of them are like, We want to join, we want you guys oh, really? to come up from our school. We are inspiring many because usually, you guys are like, that industry is a, in an industry for failures, for school dropouts. Yes. Actually, so, that was going to be my next question. A lot of parents <laughs> will say, you're going to do what? You're going to dance? Where? Ah, chop up. Uh, it's, it's not seen as something that you can actually have a career out of. Mm -hmm. Well, not in Uganda anyway, maybe in outside countries. Mm -hmm. But here, it's sort of like, mm, no, maybe you should you know, do more traditional things like lawyer. <laughs> <laughs> you know those things. <laughs> so how do your parents take this when you guys say, this is what we want to do? Anyway. I think let me tell the world the secret behind this. Mm. Dance pays. But it depends how you're taking it. Uh -huh. Yeah, it depends the level at which you are. <coughs> Go to a lower level, then you will get peanut payment. Mm. Mm. Come where we are, then you'll earn me. So mm. I don't think I'll be comfortable sitting in an office and then get that little money. Yet I can go on stage, do what I like, mm. and then I get big sums of money. Okay. So right. that's actually pays. It actually pays. All right, guys, we do have the gentleman in the building. We're talking about uh, Trojan's dance group. We're going to go for a very short break. We're going to set up the space over here for them to actually do their thing and dance. I don't see any of these guys are posing, so I'm going to all posing. Show these guys how we do it. We'll be right back. Yeah. Say with me after break. After this, break. Break. <laughs> <laughs>